Uh, back with another album review. It's been a long time since the last time I reviewed anything by Seether, and today's review is on the 20th anniversary edition of Disclaimer. Disclaimer is the band's debut album. However, the 20th anniversary edition has remastered versions of the songs, along with bonus tracks. The album was produced by, uh, produced and mixed by Jay Baumgartner. It was engineered by Dan Serta with help from Jeremy Parker and Jeff Moses. Mark Kixula helped out with the mixing. Mark Donnie was the guitar technician, and Ross Garfield was the, the drum technician. The album was recorded at NRG Recording and Larrabee Studios, though NRG was where the album was mixed. Tom Baker mastered the album at Precision Mastering in Hollywood. The original album was released on August 20th, 2002 on Windup Records. The 20th anniversary edition was completely self-produced and was supervised by Mason Williams. Ted Jensen mastered it at Sterling Mastering in Nashville. This version was released on December 16th, 2022 on Craft Recordings, which is a label that Concord uses for reissues. You may have noticed that this version has a completely different cover from the original. Well, the shrink wrap had a cover that said, well, it had a sticker that said, we always hated the original cover. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to save the sticker when I peeled the shrink wrap off, but you can see it on screen. I need to mention that this version has two discs. Disc 1 has remastered versions of the songs from the original album, plus a bonus track, and Disc 2 has live tracks. First, we're going to talk about Disc 1. The songs in order are Gasoline, 69T, Fine Again, Needles, Driven Under, Pride, Sympathetic, Your Bore, Fade Away, Pig, Fuck It, and Broken. This one ends the cover of Nirvana song, Something in the Way. This was recorded live at 99X in Atlanta on December 13th, 2002. This cover was just Sean Morgan performing the song solo, and he absolutely nailed it. There was a music video made for this cover, and I'm including a link in the description. I read online that Nirvana's album Nevermind is what inspired Sean to become a musician and that Nirvana's music essentially became the basis for some of Seether's early work. Though some of the band's er early work was also influenced by Soundgarden, Alice in Chains, Pearl Jam, and Stone Temple Pilots. Now we move on to Disc 2. While Disc 1 has, uh, has Josh Freese on drums, Disc 2 has Nick Oshiro as the drummer. The tracks on Disc 2 were recorded at Hampton Beach Casino in Hampton, New Hampshire, on uh, April 18th, 2003. The songs on disc 2 are Gasoline, 69T, Needles, Pride, Driven Under, Your Boar, Pig, Sympathetic, Fine Again, Hang On, Burrito, Fuck It, and Broken. Almost every song was originally on Disclaimer. The only exceptions are Hang On and Burrito. Hang On was recorded for Disclaimer 2 and Burrito was recorded for a karma and effect. The original album peaked at number 92 on the Billboard 200. It was also certified gold by the RIAA by selling over half a million copies in the US. The album also received mainly positive reviews from critics. I couldn't find any info on how the 20th anniversary edition performed commercially, though it does have a 4.89 out of 5 on Discogs. Now for my thoughts. Personally, I think this album is almost as good as Disclaimer 2. Since the 20th anniversary edition of Disclaimer 2 is next year, only time will tell if Seether decide to do something special for it. Overall, I highly recommend checking out this album, especially if it's, it's the 20th anniversary edition. Now is the part where I question you. Have you listened to Disclaimer? If so, what do you think about it? What's your favorite song from it? Do you think Seether will do something special for the 20th anniversary of Disclaimer 2? What are you expecting from Seether going forward? Do you think Seether should record more, more song covers in the future? Uh, let me know in the comments. If you liked the video, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Be sure to press the notification bell to notify future videos. 
Thanks for watching. I'll be back soon with another video.